What is going on, everybody? It is the middle of the week. I know I haven't done a video. I've been trying to get a few things done, and it's been a little bit jam packed to work. We have a uh, normally we have cycles that go uh, ten weeks. They crammed us into pretty much eight, so been pretty busy. By the time I get off work, you know, done, tired. But I'm gonna come live Friday. I have a box of the New Origins football coming out. If you guys haven't checked that checklist out. I'm telling you, I'm really surprised. There's like nine teams that don't have autos. Now they got relics, but you're missing like key players. Like I just noticed Kyler Murray had no autos into it. I mean, I know Origins kind of designed more for your rookie class and stuff, but take a look at it. Pay attention if you're getting into breaks. Um, because it's pretty pricey, to be honest, since there's just uh, like nine teams, no autos. I mean, you can't really price those high. But I don't have a full case. I got one box. My Chronicles baseball was cut last week, so I didn't get any of it. So, Magnus, uh, if you're watching this, uh, just so you know. I mean to send you an email. I just found out about it tonight. Uh, I picked up a box of 2020 Gold Standard Football. Two mega boxes from this last year's Optic or 1920 Optic Basketball. That's the 44 card boxes. And I found this score box that was on it. We'll take a look at it. It has something about, like, blue parallels or something into it. I, I forget what they called it. It was actually, like, what you would want to pay for a hobby box versus, like, out outwise. I don't know if it's retail or not. I just saw it, and I figured I'd grab it and add it to the order. But Friday night, I'm going to come live. We'll open up some uh, Origins football and that score for sure, see how we do. I'm um, not really busy on a mail week. I haven't been, like I said, I haven't gotten into a lot, and I haven't really won a lot either, but I haven't really gotten into a lot. Some stuff been, you know, delayed in the mail. This here, uh, it's a raw grade card. This is from Flawless. It is a one on one. I don't know if anybody actually claims it, but it's an Ohio State Noah Brown. I end up winning this uh, helping fill card for somebody, so not too sure really what to do with it. There's a one on one. Um. Yeah, I mean, Ohio State might sell. I don't know. <laughs> Somebody raw graded. I have no idea why. But can't ever complain. Jordan, this is a double. Um, another card I helped fill with somebody, and uh, I'll end up selling it. I want to say these were going between. They've been going crazy, like 170 to 200 ish. I want to say. So there's a, for being more of like what I call a lower card. Of Jordan's, there's a big flux of about 30 40 bucks in there. So I'll put, I'm probably going to put this up for sale. Um, pretty cool looking card, though. 96, uh, 97 Fleer uh, Metal Michael Jordan PSA 10. Love the look this year. But like I said, I already have. Actually, I think I have two of these upstairs already. But I, I knew I had them already. So I'll probably offer that up. This is uh, going to the old PC. Most people know I've been wanting to get one. A hit and a Raz. Cost me a. I'd say like 90 bucks at two spots. They went lower than what they were going for at the time. But it's the Bowman Chrome Sapphire Edition uh, Lubob PSA 10. I think this is a great looking card. I love the Sapphire look because you got that atomic slash uh, cracked ice, whatever you want to call it, look. This here, case, you know, five, ten years down the road, the guy goes completely. Crazy in price. I think this is one of the better ones. And I know his first Bowman's and stuff like that a lot. But when you start going just to uh, regular rookie cards, I think it'll do well. And here's a nice fact. You know, he already has two hits in the playoffs. Two hits. You know what that is? That's two more hits, I believe, that Mike Trout has in his whole time in the playoffs. I'm pretty sure. About it. Or he's doubled. I can't remember what it is. If you see but just some crazy fun facts. I've been seeing people poking at the old uh, trout collectors out there and stuff. But yeah, pretty cool goes in the PC. This will not be on sale unless I pick up a second one, which I don't know if I will. This was like amazingly hit. It was like one of them rough uh, weeks where I wasn't really getting into much, much and wham, you know. Sometimes luck turns around. Sometimes it turns around. But uh. Yeah, I'll come live Friday. If anybody's looking at these, I'm probably going to lower the price on to the HTAs. There's five left. Uh, the one box that was opened, I believe was the video's up. There was nothing hot in there rookie card class-wise. So remember, this Allen & Gitter is actually sold. Um, it's just I haven't moved the stuff around. And I'm looking at this. You guys belong to the Facebook group, The Monster Man. 
I'm going to do random teams on a half case of uh, Topps Chrome Jumbo from this year. I think right now it's going to be 27, maybe 27 spots. There'll be a couple of double, t uh, you know, combo teams. And uh, I'm thinking it's going to be 45 a spot. If you take multiples, I might drop it 40 per, but somewhere in that ballpark. So if you're interested in that stuff, I still have contenders optic basketball behind me. And I don't know what that else is back there, to be honest. I can't see behind it all. But uh, if you guys see stuff floating out of the store, um, if you don't see it on my slabs, you don't see it in the store, and you don't see it on my eBay page, it's probably been sold. But feel free, if you've seen something, ask me, because it could just be that I never put it back up after the show. Um, and it's sitting in a stack of uh, graded cards behind me. Should be getting a PSA order in for October, maybe two, maybe even three, which would be wow. Um, there's a lot in the system there. SGC order from June 5th came in last week, but guess what? They haven't graded the 9th yet. So kind of make me wonder. It's been a, over a week uh, since the last one graded out, and, and I'm trying to figure out their uh, system, and I don't think there is a system to figure out at all onto it. Yeah, come by, uh, let's say Friday, let's do 7 p.m. Eastern. Um, I know it's going to put 4 p.m. Eastern on, on the West Coast, guys, but uh, I want to try to come on a little before uh, everybody starts doing their breaks, auction sales, and stuff like that there. Hey, if you guys would be interested, I might just be able to do this into uh, the football thing this weekend. So if you guys think this would be something core, this one-on-one of, uh, what did I say his name was? Noah Brown. I was going to say Noah Fant, but that's not it. Noah Brown. I could put that up instead of the Lou Bob that we were running last week. I just got to think of what game we're going to do this week and stuff like that. So keep an eye out. You never know what day that video is going to pop out. But and it's not, gonna, like I said, I'm not going to announce giveaways. They're going to be encoded into the videos. So keep your eyes open for the guys watching and stuff like that. Uh, Nothing new has been in the store. I do have a couple things on the side here. I, it's not much to add to it. And I think that might be about it. Like I said, it hasn't been uh, too much of a productive uh, last week and this week. Uh, it's been a lot with orders and reshaping some stuff here to where a lot of the Raz rooms, to be honest, have been running what I call side junk, eBay junk, PSA 8s, PSA 9s uh, live. And just some of the stuff that's in the Facebook Raz rooms have been way, way high. And <laughs> I tried one, I hit, and I, me, I don't like to ride my luck too long. But, all right, I'll catch you guys Friday night. Look at 7 p.m. Eastern. I'll hop on. We'll open up that score football first, probably. Then we'll move into the new uh, Origins. That if anybody wants a Bowman Chrome HGA box, I think I'm going to drop them down a few. Uh, Give some people a shot at some chrome this year. But that's about it. Thank you, everybody, as always. I didn't realize I was already over eight minutes on this. Yikes. But I had a couple things on mine. I meant to write stuff down so they stayed on track, and I didn't. But I will catch you all Friday night. Have a good rest of the week, and I will see you later. Mm -hmm.